What's up vlog and welcome to IHOP in Arkansas. Came up here because A we needed to eat but also we needed to upload the vlog. But I think the Wi-Fi here is actually working pretty well. We're really impressed with it. Good job IHOP. We went to Crackle Barrel which was our first choice for breakfast but they have no Wi-Fi. So you don't serve us any good if we can't upload. So now we're here. All right, just ordered some food. I'm not really sure what we're doing today. Adriana wants to go to this tiny town place, which I think will be kind of fire. I want to go to the casino later, but I'm still interested in this alligator petting zoo thing. So, we'll see. We'll update you as we look on things we're going to be doing. Adriana's here, though. Adriana's here, and let me tell you, big shout out to IHOP Wi-Fi. I already said that. I know, but I just have to reiterate that because it's so good. We only have like eight minutes left on this vlog upload. That's unheard of, but I'm excited. Alligator petting zoo? That'll be fun. Okay. Hi, how are you? Good. Say hi to the vlog. Oh God. We made it to the tiny town. It's tiny town. This guy built a really small town apparently. We're gonna learn more about it. Adriana wanted to find out, so. It's on your shirt. I spilled water all over myself, sorry. Really? Yeah. His name was Greg Gushinsky. Wow. And he was from Pennsylvania. And it started out, it was just like a little town under the Christmas tree. My grandpa was a wood carver. In fact, he carved most of the little people you see in Tiny Town. Here on the carousel, he carved all those horses and all the little people. And the rest of the carousel is just made out of scraps of sheet metal. Absolutely amazing. So apparently this place has been here for like 70 years. Her grandfather made it, and I don't know how much you heard, but she said that he started making it and then he just never stopped. He passed away in 99, but they've had it ever since, and it's 22 different states. And he literally made the Ferris wheels from like toothpicks. All of the grass was made of sawdust that was painted. It was super incredible what he was able to do with things that we would normally throw away. And people were just pouring in after we came in, so it's super cool that this place is still open and they're able to live on their grandfather's legacy. All right, boys, alligator petting time. Let's go. It's an alligator petting zoo. How Arkansas? Yo, look at all these animals. I see animals, but I don't see gators. I need you to calm down, sir. It's a miniature donkey. Can you feed the donkey by hand, she said? Got him. I'm going to drop you another one, boy. to feed him. He looks hungry. He looks like Kimber. Hey. My guy, you hungry? I got some for everybody. Just doing my part. Didn't I already give you some? I feel like Kimber. Adrian is filming. Y'all, this tortoise is ginormous. It's an African tortoise. It's whoa. That one's sneaking up on you. They got the lettuce, not us. Oh, big hungry. What's up, my guy? Hello. Are you a cow or a goat? Adriana made a friend. He likes me. Does he? Yeah. This goat keeps <laughs> eating Adriana's shoelace. Hey, big hungry. Chill. Goats were cool. Emo was cool. Rabbits were cool. But you know why we're here. It's gator time. Adrian is still hanging out with this little goat over here, though. He's so cute, though. All right, I'm a little nervous. I've never been close to an alligator, but we're about to find out. So let's go, boys. No. No bread beyond this point. I didn't bring any bread. I want to feed any of them you'd like. Stick it right out. They look freaked out. This one looks so hungry. Ah! 
Look at that one on top of the other ones. Yeah, they'll start climbing on each other. Oh, bro. You want to do it as well? Oh, I'm stressed. All right, we're about to hold an alligator here in a second. I'm a little stressed, but it's fine. I don't. This guy won't chill out. I've got another one in there that's normally pretty chill. That's awful. <laughs> this can't be a happy face. I'm not gonna lie. This is arguably the worst experience, bro. Ugh. That just stressed me out. It was like holding a leather boot that was breathing. You see? How dangerous are alligators? Dude, really dangerous. <laughs> I thought you were about to be like, they get a bad rap. Yeah. They're really dangerous. Crocodiles, for example, are so dangerous. The only reason alligators aren't as dangerous as them is because they're not as aggressive, really. You can feel them breathing. I know, that's what freaks me out. Well, he's alive. Just <laughs> I will not be holding these alligators. It's like they're like, hey, get off me. That was hot fire. That was super cool. I was really nervous hurting, holding the alligator, if you couldn't tell. But it was super cool to see the goats and the alligators and everything. You can't do stuff like that in Dallas. What happened? It's super hot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we just bring our jugs usually and Is it supposed to be hot? Yeah, it's a hot spring. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. Believe it or not, that was really hot. I guess because it's like the natural hot springs water, you can everyone, all the locals come and fill up jugs of water. So we wanted to test it out, but maybe I'm crazy because I thought it was gonna be cold, but it was really like scorching hot, like burn yourself hot. So boys, all right, so y'all, Adriana found a magic show, so we came to come watch it. I'm actually really excited about it because if you don't know, I'm obsessed with magic. I used to do amateur magic shows. No, I didn't do magic shows. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. When I was little, I used to do a bunch of magic shows. Nothing crazy, just some amateur stuff, you know. You think I was gonna do a trick? I didn't. Uh, but yeah, so when I heard about this, I was like, we're going. Arkansas is really cool because there's been a lot of like random things to do and just like really fun stuff to do. So it's cool. Like today we went to the pool. We went to um, find the hot springs so we can refill our water bottles. We went, where else did we go? We held alligators. Oh my God, we held the alligators. You guys were there for that. Then we'll see what happens later. My dog's got in a fight earlier. You missed that. There's been a lot going on, but you know, it's all good. It's all good. Adrian is just eating snacks. How are the snacks? Popcorn's great. So this is called the Magic House of Maxwell Blade. Guess who we're seeing? Not Maxwell Blade. We're yeah. not seeing the correct guy, but it's fine. Yeah, we're seeing the wrong guy. <laughs> hey, that wasn't my fault. <laughs> I told Raul. We're not seeing the wrong guy, by the way. There's just a show before the show, but we rented a car and it's getting picked up at 10, so that show wasn't over until 9.45, so... Yeah. Maybe we stay till 9.45. The first show's either gonna be so good I wanna stay or so bad I wanna stay. <laughs> yeah, it can't be mid. I don't know if I want to stay. It's a little small in here. What is happening? If I put my hand down, if I crack my neck. Awesome. The only other rule is no matter what I do, do not put this card in your mouth. Are we good?